to Turkey now, and just as crews battling to bring wildfires under control, devastating floods have decimated northern parts of the country. The death toll climbed to 38 on Friday as President Recep Tayyip Erdogan declared flood-hit regions as disaster zones. Tanya Dendrinos reports. Vehicles tossing in the torrent. This terrifying eyewitness footage captured the scene in northern Turkey just days ago. Roads turned to rivers as buildings simply crumbled. And this is the aftermath, a mangled heap of mud, debris and belongings. I went out and all of a sudden floodwaters gushed behind me. I couldn't look back. It swallowed homes, people, everything. President Erdogan visited Gastamonu on Friday, declaring flood-hit regions along the country's Black Sea coast as disaster areas. We cannot bring back our people who lost their lives, but our state has the power, opportunity and determination to compensate for any loss other than that. A mammoth search and rescue operation is now underway. More than 1,700 people have been evacuated and hundreds of villages have been left without power. Turkey's interior minister labelling the situation as the worst flood disaster he's ever seen. This on the back of wildfires in the south of the country and across the Mediterranean. In the week a landmark UN climate report sounded a code red for humanity. Tanya Dendrinos. BBC News.